In this video, I'll show you how you can create a shared folder in Google Drive. Now, a shared folder is great because you can add a group of people to a folder, and then that group of people can then all upload media, images, files, and they can also download media, images, and files from the folder. I like to use this when I've been on a group holiday, so everyone can upload their photos to one shared Google Drive folder. So to do this, you want to head over to Google Drive, to get there, just go to Google, just search for Drive, and you just want to click on the first one and then go to Drive. Now, the chances are you're probably already logged in to your Google account. If you are, it will take you straight into Drive. Now, what you need to do here is you need to go to New, then go New Folder, and you can then call this folder whatever you want. So let's say I've been on holiday or vacation to Thailand. So I'm going to call this Thailand Group Picks. After I've named this, I can then create this folder and then it should create in Google Drive. Now what I can do is open this folder and start to add my files to this. So the way I would add my files is I would open up my file explorer and I've got four different images here of Thailand, which I may have taken, which I can just drag into Google Drive. Now everyone else in this group can do the same. We just need to invite them now. So we wanna right click on the group folder name, then go to share and then share again. And what you can do here is you can invite people to this group folder so they can add and upload and also download the files and folders. What we can do now is we can add people to this group folder so they can add, remove and upload their own photos and media. So I'll just add my email address here. So I've just added another email address that I own. You can write a message and notify people that you're inviting them. And if you want them to be able to upload folders and files, you want to have them as an editor, then click send. That's going to then invite them to this group where they can then accept that invite. So this is what the invite will look like. They can just head to their email and then open it. And once they are then part of the group, they can then add and download images as well. So you can see this is a shared folder. That's how you do it. I hope that quick video did help you out.